Welcome to Midnight Mule FPL. I'm Midnight Mule and this is the video for match day seven, the final of the Euros. I'm going to show you my team, which is going to be pretty much like everyone else's team. But before that, let's see who did well in the semi-finals. The top score for the semi-finals in our league was 49 points. That was managed by two teams, Panna with FPL Panna and Kipax Kid with Kipax Commandos. So looking at FPL Panna first, Captain Olmo with 14, Kane 8 and Simon 7, and Bappe 5 and nothing else. For Kipax Kid, that was managed with Captain Olmo 14, Kane 8, Simon 7, and Bappe 5, and again, nothing else. Currently top of our league and way ahead of everyone else is Floris with Lakaka FC with 403 points. So surely they're going to win our league, but who knows, something crazy could happen in the final, I guess. They managed 42 points. Captain Olmo again, 14 points. Simon, 7. Mbappe, 5. And that's all. As for me, I'm all the way down in third in 12th. And I had Captain Olmo, 14 again. Yamal, 9. Mbappe, 5. And that's all. And I've had Yamal the whole time because I thought he was a good player. This is my squad as it looks at the moment. And as you can see, I have no defenders playing, so they're all out. And two of my forwards are no longer in the competition, so they're out. I still have my limitless chip, which means I can do whatever I like. So there's no problem there. So what I'm going to do, being the lazy person I am, I'm just going to remove all the players and then choose who I'm going to have playing. I'll leave Simon and Pickford in there because, of course, they'll be the two keepers I choose. So starting with the midfielders, I'm going to be playing five midfielders. I've got this ordered by points. I'm happy with Olmo. Just about okay with Ruiz. Bellingham's all right. And I like Saka. I do like Williams. I like Rice. I've got to choose between one of those. I'm going to go with Rice, I think, even though Williams is definitely very exciting. As for the forwards, I'm going to go for two forwards. Obviously, Yamal. I'm going to guess Kane's not going to play. And I hope he doesn't play because I've not got him already. And some people don't have any chips left and they might be stuck with a non-player. I'm going to stick Watkins in there for now. Which means I've got three defenders I need to choose. So for them, I'm going to go with Gehi, of course. And I do want Carvalho. And then it's between Laporte, Walker or Stones. Let's say I will go for Laporte. And then I'll play Pickford as my main keeper. We're going to know the lineups before we have to commit, which means apart from Watkins, I should be having all my players playing. So perhaps my other player to be something like I go for Kane, perhaps up front, but start Kane on the bench. And then in defence, really doesn't matter who I put in there. Let's say Stones and Walker for now. Oh, no, not Walker then. Cucurella. And then my captain... I don't know yet who I put it on, but I may well leave the old captain's hat on Olmo. Most teams are going to look the same, so most scores are probably going to be the same for the final. I'm all right with my position as it is at the moment. So that's pretty much it. And it's very nice to think FPL is just about back. And there we have it. That's what happened in the semi-final. And then my rather generic plans for the final. Obviously, we're all going to get very similar scores, but hopefully we've all had a bit of fun playing this rather silly competition. Thank you very much for watching. Bye.